angry. Hate him. Hey, give me a tough one. Hey, any of you? Supergirl issue number 33. There we go. We're fighting back to Ogozai's nonsense. Yay. Yep. Now, now, oh, oh, you know what? I want to go read the issue. We got to do a video with the Superhead book. Before I send this book, I know the time to do the Superman nonsense. I'm going to go for mine anyway. Yep. Plus, this, this will be the final issue. I think I'm going to read a Supergirl issue for a while. Yep, you guys. This is the end of Ogozai's nonsense. At least for a while. Yay, more of that crap. Also, this book doesn't contain out of my mind for the character. John, I'm gonna send this book. Yep. Yeah. 18 is 7, I'm doing myself. <laughs> Thank Bendis. Thanks. There you go. So, I just want to find on this final issue of Logos Art, Stupid, Stupid Nonsense. Yep. Enjoy the show. See ya. Oh, I am. As you can tell from my intro, I you can tell I find the issue interesting. Why? You'll find out. What's this up? The current time with, um, with Kerouac and Supergirl now, wait, when she's there, go, Logos are, Kerouac Krypton, or Wedgie. The quest for the truth sent me to the far east of the universe. From Mogo to Vega, I found a friend, or so I fought, and fought an enemy. And I just got my family, yep. And we talked about the Fanagor, with, um, John Zirko. Why do you get bored to death? I mean, how long do they think we can just sit here doing nothing? Patient John, we have visitors here. We must be respectful of their ways, he must say. Yeah, Zod actually said, said quote, You speak of our captors, all, you, all your time on earth made you suck beyond reason, Kal-El. Yeah, I've been a dead buddy. They wouldn't be a weapon this powerful with that if it put a threat. Yep. Yeah, but you have what was that axe, basically. What's the going to go? Just burn our huts now. We would body count in what pounds and millions. Yep. And we come back to the ruin of Krypton earlier with the um, character, uh, quote. I'll take that. No one did Krypton on my watch. Stupid girl, you think you can join the Zara? You shall fail again! Ugh, I hate Ozar. You want back, huh? Here you go! And she, you, uh, the smack with Zara. Uh, Yay! In the eye! Ah, my eye! Oh, boo hoo! Uh, I hate Ozar, so kind and boring. Yep. And the acting now destroyed. But super good. Give it up, Zara. You're acting fine. And you have sick and concerned that want, waiting for you to give us an excuse to. <laughs> What's so funny? You, you have to kill me for I will never kill you. How to make you a Kryptonian scum? I'm, I'm okay with that. It's so good. And they get caught by the um, black guard with the super girl. Cal, Zod looks so confused. I feel it. Zod is glowing. So, who did this? Oh, them. Defending a black guard. Seven hells indeed. Seven hells? What did that even mean? Yeah, but you can be on the ground. This story takes place in Superman issue number 14. Yeah, with, with the rest of the Kryptonian and, um, little we'll, we'll cast by, by the Black Fennigans. I know, I know, I know, it's confusing, but stay with me. Um, Super is a quote. But now, all that rage is gone. And where does that leave me? I was so angry for so long. Who am I? Yep, it's gone. I feel that's it. I'm a human again. Yep. Kryptonians, I'm here to ask you to the security council. So, pardon me, but I've got out a few. Say so about the crime of the council. Yep. And we see the, um, Fennigan as the Kryptonian Super, Super Girl, John, and Zod going to the, um, council with, um, Super Girl. Behave, he's serious. Maybe just don't record the chicken. Okay, do you think we get a last meal? <laughs> okay, wait, that's funny. And when Zod said a quote, what, what the young men have that little joke? They will not hold up the door soon enough. That's grim. I bet Zod find the fans of too upbeat. I don't know if fact. What now? And the sacred has been a current. Yeah, I've been too many to know 14. John said it's a timeout. And then we cut back to the whole uh, meeting with the two minutes to know 14. With two minutes to go. Ooh, look at you, Cal. You are so good at this. Your empathy, your diplomacy, your morality. Heck, I want to vote for you, and you are not even running for anything. And John looks to be every bit of his father's son. Maybe it is a seminal, seminal moment, moment when the universe comes together, nice for the betterment of all. Who joined our truth first? Is it a generation thing? I know. This is a tough one to read. What is that? Another attack? John said, I'm super good. Yeah, he's super good. We got some sort of portal? Great, wow. And I'm seeing the weird superhero show up in Superman is now 14. Yay. And basically, I'm seeing the superhero show up a quote. <gasps> We we did we did we did green from the previous century. We are we the superheroes. We we have all all dedicated to our, our lives to our superhero in honor of the 
in honor of this very day. This is the greatest day in the age of hero we call it the Unity Day. They, they said they had a gift for us. A gift. And then we talk about the Supergirl returning to um, her, her boyfriend, Zendor, who basically tell her we were going on a date. And there's just her missing video is cut off. Yeah, same point. Next, Superman's here. Go. Oh, okay. No sneaking him on Ellie there. So stay with the day, huh? Indeed it was. How, how are you doing with all this, Superman said. Superman's here. Go. I'm surprised you're good. Maybe? No. But definitely better than that before I start the journey. I feel like it more. Me. Superman's here. Go. Oh, I, I can see that. I'm glad that the journey has brought you peace. You deserve it. I may not have experienced Krypton as you did. I can say with certainty that all people would be as proud of you as I am, cousin. Older cousin, don't forget. Yes, what right about you, Cal? Yep. Two minutes ago. I hope that that isn't unfounded. This whole United Plan thing has come out on fast. Maybe too fast. I'm not sure if. Stop. You have always been here for me, and now it's my turn. Everyone admires you because you are a good man. No matter what the situation, you are always good. I get the need to love you, even if you can't see it. Two minutes ago. You make me blush. What about you? What's next for the girl's seal? I guess I need to think about that uh, now. Excuse me, there you go. I feel like I've shaken off so much negativity that I'm with a new person. I can actually do something for myself without any guilt. Such as... Maybe... Yeah, and she's had to go to her degree. And she gets Superman when it's, when it's hard. With, um, super girls, there you go. You're gonna be out here for a while. So if need you now at all times, right? I'll make you proud, I promise. You always do. Do you need a ship? I'm sure Jarrell had all you on it. I hop on my suit with the sense so I tell me and tell you give John. Wait, what? When the hell did she, she do that? Never mind. And she just crept over with the with her. And she was like, Me too, Carol. Me too. And the comedy video at the with Supergirl back in Natural City. With back at home. How's the fucking night for now? Not dead damage. And that the comic end. Ugh, this time with a great weight of time. Oh, I am. I think you tell my we got that. You can tell about it. She was stupid. Why? You'll find out. Let's get started. What, what's that always said by, um, Maguire? Maguire, all my opinion, it's, um, it's fine. It's okay. But well, it's not good. I don't read all work. Far from it. But you know what? You know what it is? It's okay at best. There ain't no time at all. No, it's fine. We can get story itself. So, okay. Let's so, submit issue number 14. This story can be quite the fuck. I mean, dear God, I thought the Super Girl book would burn in the Super book. I turned out I was wrong. This story is even more of a crud the fuck. It tried to laugh at the low results of the Bender stuff, and it doesn't really laugh at that story. We actually get interrupted by the old black, black guard fan again and stuff. And when it tried to get into the number 14, it doesn't really connect well because it doesn't make sense. And another thing that confused me about the story is that what happens to the old circle stuff? Did the circle to get dropped? I guess we're not doing circle anymore because that so it could be dropped. So you're telling you wasted like 32 issues of Gendaro, all that circle crap, all this time we super getting revenge, and we don't get revenge, I'm gonna get bullshit. Oh, by the way, you want my logo to all around to him? Well, if there's any issue issue on 14, you don't have it though, he better get captured by the black, black, black guard. And that is his story. So you wasted all the time for super going against the logo's all, getting the axe again. Kicking over that ass, but that's actually pretty cool, I mean, pretty badass. And then you, and you end it, but it was not super, not gonna get any revenge, but why don't you just go back to Earth? What the point of doing all the circles on the third point? What the fuck, what the, this is stupid. God, this is not, you know, one of the worst story I ever read. Speaking of uh, story now, I think, oh my, we'll get to John and Super Great Interaction. Okay, John and Super Great Interaction might be actually kind of sweet. As I mentioned before, I'm still not fan of Jarman Singer as you would be an age to a teenager. I'd rather Jarman Singer as you would be a 10 year old or so than be a teenager because I don't like that clumsy. It doesn't work with John. John should be a 10 year old kid. Not be a teenager so. I, I, I just don't get that logic. It still pays me on the Jarman age up. It's still cute though, but it just doesn't work for me. What's the other weird superhero stuff? Okay, the reason Super Arrow, they do show up like in Superman issue number 14, but they do the same thing like they did in Super Arrow issue number, issue number 14. Act for nothing. They just show up and then Super Arrow talk to, to her boyfriend, who apparently had the uh, Adam John to go to the future. So, yeah, if you want to answer but with Super Arrow meeting with Super Arrow, <laughs> too bad. We, we don't get to see that interaction. Nope, that's our panel. 
So you tell you what a we just super time for this book and I got nothing? No we super you talk to the supergirl? No mind I talk to supergirl? Nothing? Food the pro don't we just super if you're not gonna have it into a supergirl. God it you stupid Speak of stupidity, yeah my what what's in a super good boyfriend? I don't care with that he's boring, so he's not gonna point. I'm a super good time shoot man. Okay, well, wait, did I have a super good shoot man? It's kinda sweet, it's cute, and I don't even want to talk to each other about Krypton. And super good time shoot man is a good man. That is kinda sweet, that's cute. But I want to move on with this. When is super good have to be to, to get the ticket off of Joel? When does he build that suit by John's suit to, to her suit? When did when did that happen? When when did she get the, the, the schematic to build a super top hint and symbol? I'm guessing that might have been what our panel, but we don't get to answer that. Let's get to the ending of a sec. Okay, the ending. But she will go back to Earth and now she's in Nigel City again. And that's how her tie in with the Union Saga. So you're telling me you wasted 33 years to Super Game Revenge and we don't get a revenge story. All we got a bullshit story with no end of the circle, no end of the whole anti rogues are crap, nothing. Like Superman, man, it is a waste of time. I can't just issue a waste of my time. Like, ugh. I, I thought Supergirl book would burn them this, but turn out wrong. Supergirl book, it's the same with Bendis did. We have a story, we have unfinished. Motherfucker. <coughs> yeah, I can tell my way I'm not happy. It's just you decided to be a waste of time. And then you need to be breaking. I want to talk about this train wreck. I think it's buried. Alright, um. With all, with all that said, what the hell Supergirl is number 33? I just kind of with a 3 out of 5 stars. Is it perfect? No. Is it better than the Superman book? Eh, uh, kind of. But it just reads really more questions than answers. The service stuff is all pointless. The whole conspiracy is cooked on all pointless. The whole was all pointless. Like, this book that didn't answer what was all. I just gave me jack and shit. And as Supergirl book, this book is just a waste of time. It's a damn shame. I'm loving the story. But then it went all down there with that one the Bendis nonsense. Then you're trying to tie his bandage out there's a horrible idea so woman has a prize. God damn it, this story has to do with the weight of time. At a conclusion, you inside a supergirl, it sucks. This conclusion is just bad. Speaking of that, I don't mind me knowing why why does Supergirl not react to Zod and and hit escape? Wait a minute. I view something. I'm about the Zod stuff. Why didn't Supergirl talk to Zod Zod and you know, about the crypto destruction? Did we miss that? Oh who am I kidding? I forgot this story didn't yeah, you have to have super talk to Zod. Well, she does have Zod only a few seconds. <laughs> Whatever. Who cares? This story with the time. <laughs> anyway, then. That's my video. Super Girl Issue number 33. Spoil free puzzle. Uh, free the content. Right? You better chain act. You already do it. Also, how do you do it? Do you need to sell it now? Super Girl, I feel at the conclusion of her story with Dogo Zara and the event of Krypton. Free up carnival. Also, I can refer to on Twitter. Free up Scott my channel. Free on Twitter side. Free up the. Free the bag, I use your animal set on story. Put it with the can, I'll talk it away. I'm gonna super go. See ya. Bye. Morgan Jenga, you're better than this. I know you like better. M fix your book. Actually, you know what? Screw Bendis. This is Bendis' fault on this one. I'm gonna see ya. Bye. I'm gonna super